Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today we are gonna be doing the second part of our Rebel Clash booster box. Yesterday we did nine packs and we got some pretty nice pulls. So you guys should go check out that video. I'll put the link to it in my description. But today we're gonna be doing this chunk of the booster box. So that is the first half done after we're done this video. Let's shuffle them up. So there are two cards that I have, two specific cards that I am looking for. Those are the Rainbow Rare Dragapult V Max and the Full Art Phalanx V, the Almighty Full Art Phalanx V. That card, best thing in the world. It's so, so far, it is my favorite V card that they've ever released. Other than maybe the Rainbow Rare uh, Gigantamax Pikachu. <clears throat> so we're going to get into this video now. Nine packs to go. Starting with the first pack. Cinderace. So I'm actually recording this video not even a minute after I was finished recording the last video because I can't really wait that long. But after this video, I'm probably going to go to sleep and finish the rest of the box in the morning. If not, then I'm just going to keep opening and opening and opening until I eventually fall asleep on the camera. So, first card. Electric Energy. Charge Bug. Gun Tank. Pull you. Magic Carp. Look at the Pikachu in the background. I think that's the same artist who did like the alternate art for the Dene GX and EVGX. Invulsory, Growlithe, Impidimp, Reverse Rare Ice Cube, so first pack hollow, and a regular rare Sigilyph. So yep, Inteleon pack. We have a Grass Energy, Electrode, Zatu, Mombre, Magikarp, Meditite, Milsery, Growlithe, Impidip, Reverse Uncommon Lexio, and a regular rare Unfeathered. Okay, not a very good start. I'm getting more tired by the minute. It is so late. Okay. Fire energy. Pelp a toad. See something shiny at the back. Scoop up net. Chat up. Applin. Atena. Aracuda. Laren Meowth. Surskit. First capacious bucket, and could this be the phalanx? Could this be that this could be phalanx? We'll see. Ah, uh, it's not the phalanx, it's freaking Sonia. But full art trainer card nonetheless. I didn't even know that full art Sonia was in this set. So, pretty nice pull. Hopefully, it's not the only full art we get in this opening because I really want that phalanx V. It's been so long since I've gotten a full art trainer card. They just they just haven't been anywhere for a long time. Metal Energy, Tranquil, Metcham, Orgrim, Sandy Gast, Pulpix, Coughing, Shinx, Glaring Your Mask, Barboach, Common, Reverse, and a Meg Mortar, regular rare. Look at that. That's some that's some nice artwork. 
you can go check out my Instagram. It's just 2230YT. I occasionally post Pokemon cards, some pictures of things that I've made, or announcements for videos. I'm just talking, you know, like, I'm, like I am right now. Do you talk? Carcol, beware, Skyla, Timple, Bulby, Galarian Cursula, so sad. Doxel, Galarian Mr. Mime, not so sad. <laughs> Surskit, and a Galarian Darmanitan. That that thing happened the exact exact same way last episode. Got Galarian Cursula, so sad. Then a card, and then a Galarian Mr. Mime, not so sad. We have three packs left after this one. Hopefully we can do the the thing that happens. And we get a full art and a V card. Hopefully for every single episode and one of them gets like one of the full arts gets replaced with a rainbow rare. Glare and Farfetch'd, Hone Edge, Reverse Common Aracuda, and a Abomb Snow Rainbow Rare. Um, I would have thought we would have gotten another hollow or reverse rare or something. By now. I don't even know why, but I, I have like, you guys see my background all the time. All you see is a couple of tins, but really it's so much bigger. Like, I, I could, I could just quickly show you guys how big it really is. Like you got Pokemon tins, and then there's just random Five Nights at Freddy's tin. goes all the way up. It is a lot bigger <laughs> than what you guys see. Okay. Back of the pack. We have Dark Energy, Sonya, Masquerade, Hatchrim, Funnelby, Phantom, 3P, Learn Farfetch'd. Pone Edge, Palace Hand, Reverse Uncommon, and Ice QV. I didn't even know that was in this set. Just like Sonya, we got two unexpected cards, but that goes perfectly with their Ice Q Reverse Rare. Okay, so we've got a full art and a V. Can we go even further and get like three, ho three more hollows? We got two packs left, so maybe a reverse hollow and a hollow. And then maybe the four things. Psychic energy, speed energy, menopod, heliolisk, sandy ghast, vulpix, coughing. It's weird. It, it, it always catches me off guard when I see like Pokemon like coughing. And Crow Gunk as Dark type. So weird. I don't know why they did that. Reverse Bronzor. Regular rare. Rare Regus. Um, speaking of random types, comment down below what your favorite Pokemon type is. I don't know what mine is. I like a lot of Pokemon types. But holy crap, we're already on the last pack. Maybe we could end it off with a bang. Even if it's just a hollow, we need another hollow at least. Or even we could end it off with a big bang, like a V card or something like that. So we have a Fighting Energy, Burning Scarf, Indeedy, Skyla, Applin, Hatena, Woo 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 Woo, Aracuda, Ah, Galarian Meowth, Surskit, Galarian Mr. Rhyme Reverse Rare. So we've got the hollow. And a holographic colossal. So we got two hollows in one pack. That wasn't a very bad episode. It's barely as, like, not as long as the last episode was. We're off by like five minutes. That's probably because I had to open up stuff. I still haven't edited it, edited it yet. I still haven't cut out some of the parts that needed to be cut out. But. See you guys tomorrow when we open up the next chunk of packs of our Rebel Clash booster box. See you guys later. Bye-bye.